Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode four <laughs> of Ocean Block. So yeah, uh, we're back again and ready to go. Make get some stuff done. Uh, I do have a couple of things sort of laid out and ready to go. Uh, let's go have a look. I have added a couple of path blocks, some trees. Oh, Kitty's saying hello. Uh, I planted the garden. Ooh, got two tegas. There we go, that's perfect. <laughs> and I added a little tree farm back here so I could get some more wood. It's not the best, but hey. And I made a room a little bit bigger uh, with plans for going down further. We can go down even further uh, uh, it's because I'm, I'm hitting water. I'm hitting water over here and uh, <laughs> yeah, the, the pathway down over here so we gotta go down if we want some more room on this island. Uh, I'm trying to get another iron converted, but it's just not, it's not one to go. It's been there for a while. Uh, but I do have a couple of goals. Man, you can't really see this. Uh, my main goal is to upgrade our sluice to the iron sluice and an iron mesh. I'm coupling that together. And then secondary goal is going to be a manual pump if we get enough iron. Hopefully we can do that. Um, but I also had planned a cobblestone generator and it's not going to take away from our sluice. So I think I want to go ahead and do that first because uh, we, we have the buckets already made. Please stop. You scratching me? We have the buckets already made. I want to put this up. Well, those don't stack. Uh, but we need an iron bucket and an iron, iron bucket of lava and an iron bucket of water in order to make a cobblestone generator. And we happen to have that stuff ready. And I only need, oh, I need a bit of glass, so we'll have to go back up. I have to go back up. I do believe I got a bit of glass. So we do bucket, bucket. Oh, I'm going to need that. I'm going to need that open. So I have to make uh, two compressed cobble. Boop, boop. And some logs. Oh, I did that backwards. Boop. We get our buckets back, so that's good. Oh, and we got a quest for that. Let's put our buckets back over here. Awesome. Got the cobble in. Oh, we're going to need a barrel or something for this. I think I'm just going to make good old-fashioned drawer. There we go. And we'll put this down. Oh, that completed another quest. I think I'm gonna put this down over here. It's also a light source. I wonder if I can take this out. I can. Pushed F7 and I'm not seeing any. And it marks. Awesome. Okay, so 
<laughs> that's out of the way. We should be getting cobble as we speak and do stuff. Okay, for the sluice, I do have a little bit of iron over here. I have one iron. Thought I had more. <gasps> I do. That's what I was like. Whoa, I miscounted. <laughs> but I didn't. Okay, so that should be enough. Let's go down there again. Oh, I'll need a string. Dang it, I keep forgetting stuff. Got a string for the mesh. That should be it. I have sticks, so... Um... Let's go ahead and pick this guy up. It says pickaxe, but an axe works, and it's wooden, so I think it's okay. So for the sluice to upgrade it, we're going to need to make some nuggets. Ooh, I didn't I need that last iron. Dang it. Who needs it bad? Oh no, no we don't. I have the one iron on me. We just need to smelt it. I wonder, can I smelt it in here? I don't think so. Um, use a bucket, that's okay. That's okay. Let's go up here and smelt our little uh, bit of iron. I'm okay with wasting that charcoal. Because I had so much and I didn't have to burn any wood for it. Awesome. Okay, let's make this puppy. Oh, I need the chain. I was hoping I would have found some. So now we have our sluice and our mesh. So we can put this back down. Oh, I was just thinking, oh, there's our iron. Finally, now that I don't need it. Actually, we do need it, but I don't. <laughs> I need another bucket to make a manual pump, and, and I need two more iron to go with that. But I'm all out of stone. I guess I could smelt some more. Let's go smelt some more stone. Smelt up enough for two. Let's see. We'll smelt that up. To monsters. This is cabbage, tomatoes, potatoes, carrots, and wheat. Uh, the tomatoes and cabbage actually have recipes. That's the wrong. That's the wrong spot. They actually have recipes, so that's why I planted those. I didn't know if the tomatoes from the thermal series is the same, but they were different seeds, so.
And I checked, and the tomatoes and the cabbage actually have recipes too. So let's put our nuggets away. Oops. Um, I wonder, can I recombine these slabs? No. I looted some, uh, off that little raft out there, I looted some sideways slabs, and I was able to recombine those, so I didn't know if, uh, you know, that was a thing. I really want to get at least one of these, yes, going down there, so while we're doing other stuff, this can be converting. Hopefully. Uh, now, for the iron sluice, it says it holds more water, but it doesn't. It actually uses less water. So that's a thing. Uh, but the good thing about the iron sluice is that it can be automated with items, input and output. It says it on there. Look, item input and output can be automated. It's still a bit on the slow side, but it seems to use a lot less fluid than before. It says there that uh, it uses less fluid, but it says somewhere else that it holds more. I don't know. Don't ask me. So we can. Oh, I don't have enough for a hopper. Uh, I really want that bucket, though. And... Okay, so we have the iron sluice and the iron mesh. Boop. The manual pump is going to take a bit. Let's just put this back up there. Yeah, so let's go ahead and sleep and we'll go exploring. Uh, while our iron is converting. Hopefully we'll come back to that being converted. And we'll put this over here. So we've got a couple more slots. Oof. I got so much wood. Oh, I bet let's save a little bit of space. And go put this cobble down the middle. It should be fine. Let's put the sticks there though. Oh, sleep. Don't want the phantoms to come get me while I'm out and about. Alright. I really like how the island's coming along. I put some trees back up to add a little more interest. Um, we went the slime way last time. So we're going to go this way this time. Oh! <laughs> I push shift to, to go faster because like in the game I play seven days, you have to hold down shift to run. <laughs> Oopsie! I've been playing Diablo 2 so I keep hitting I to hit my inventory open. Some lily pads and some chainmail leggings. Not the best of record. Uh, you can recycle the records, you get some black dye. Although I don't know what you would need black dye for. Uh, especially when. Oh, I did kill a squid and it had a hat and it had a black. Uh, an ink sack. 
black guy in the sack. My axe is almost broken. Oh, we got some stuff. 32 stone! Oh, that's fantabulous. That's a few iron that we don't have to worry about. And leather! We got the leather for the backpack. Oh, that was good. That was so good. I might want to not loot any more uh, campfires since my axe is so low. Oh, there's a lot on this one too. That's okay, we got quite a bit. A bed. That's okay, we got a couple of those. I think that one's green. There's a green one. I don't know the difference. Does it say we didn't get our reward? Uh -oh. oh, I thought it said if you look on them. right click on it, it shows you the uses. Or oh, this one can drop a magnet, a treasure bag, small crate, so uh, the white ones are more common. They got a chance to drop beds, stone, uh, little stuff. Oh, and the leather. The white ones can drop leather. What can the blue barrels drop? Oh, they can drop an iron chest. I haven't seen a blue barrel, though, but we can loot it now if we find one. Uh, does it say on the quest where you can find the blue barrels. Break a blue barrel. Found on rafts and structures underwater. Huh. I haven't, I don't think I've seen a blue barrel uh, in any of the playthroughs that I've done before. Oh, this has a crate of eggplants and a silver small axe. Ooh, got some more sand. Now that we have iron, we'll want to try and fast track it to get up to gold. Ooh, we found a little... Let's go to that first, because that has quite a bit of barrels in it. Always put a torch to let it know, and I'm gonna take this Ooh, cauldron. Why not? A white barrel. It's more leather. No. It's a green one. Ooh, an iron spike. That is nice. That's a lot of iron. And. Uh, haven't gotten, oh, got some glass, that's good. Uh, we haven't gotten like a uh, mob master as an upgrade or as a quest reward or loot yet. More sponges, okay. Boop, boop, boop. Spikes, that was a good find. So it takes two of those to make a mob masher. Uh, 
And those are like a block of iron and three swords and like three more iron. So it's a lot of iron in one of those. Much better than getting wooden spike. Ooh, got a miner's pick. And a dark fridge. So we can maybe hit up Ooh. this guy has one crate. That's perfect for the space we have. There we go. Now let's go back because we want to put our other stone down and hopefully the first one has converted over. <laughs> Unfortunately, we did not get any iron. If we had a recycler, we could get some iron back out of uh, all this chain mail, but it takes a lot of iron to make a recycler. Definitely worth it. But it does take a lot of iron. But we'll start getting more iron now that we got an iron sluice. I think um, after this bucket, I'm going to go right into getting a hopper for that sluice. Yeah, I need, I need to put all the stuff up. So put that. Put that over there, save a slot, put that over there, uh, let's get this out, get our iron out, hopefully our iron has converted. Um, I think since, whoa, lighting glitch? Well, it's not S7. Oh, it is. It is allowing mobs to spawn there. Oh, that, that is no good. Um, hang on a second. Let's try the old log out and log back in. See if that helps. That normally fixes everything. Probably because we had it unloaded. I get some water while we're loading in. That fixes it. Yay! <laughs> All right. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay. Um, what I wanted to do, and I don't have enough iron for that either. We're just going to have to make a small chest to gather, to collect this stuff. Oh. Um, so we can try to get our iron this way. We only need one more. We got 
two chunks, three chunks. It's pretty common with the iron mesh. Yes. Okay. That was a heck of a lot quicker. Um, I guess we could try and get a high temperature heat source now that we have lava, but our iron, yes. Now we can get the manual pump. That will help with the automation. We can actually crank it and what am I doing? <laughs> I don't know. Well, that's melting. I guess we can go. We're going to harvest with my hammer. Boop, 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 boop. Yes. Okay. Bucket. Okay, bucket, bucket, bucket. The other two buckets also need three stone. I think it's wood and not logs. This will be great. I've been working on um, a few things that have been bothering me about my videos. I don't know what to do about the sound. I did turn some of my, uh, my Minecraft sounds down so they shouldn't be as loud. I could probably even turn it down some, like, some blocks down. Because uh, my voice isn't coming through as well as I would like it to. Oh, sure. Now you come. Now you come through. Okay. Um, we need the buckets of water. I should make this a tinker's table down here. So, probably not. But we can always try. No, because you right click. Okay. Well, I'm going to try. We got our buckets back. So we didn't lose any iron. How's our cobble coming? Ooh, we got 10 stacks. Nice. Um, I'm thinking since we need a lot of iron, we got the stone. We can let me F7 off. Uh, we can make three more. to help us out with the iron. Oh, that's fully grown. I didn't look it. Water. 
No! <laughs> I'm okay to get water now. Oh, there we go. A little bit trickier. Gotta get it just right. All right, so we have one iron, plus we got three more. So if we can get enough for another iron. Or we might just sieve until we get enough iron for a hopper. Uh, got one. Go ahead and crank this bad boy up. Um, yeah, I, I was trying to get that iron to convert <laughs> for the longest time and it did not want to go so i sat here for several days several several minecraft days and it was not going hopefully we're getting quite a bit more iron out of these because we're going to need it oh we can also get into uh tinkers because uh, I made some clay in here. You can use it with a bucket of water, one sand, and one gravel. That's way better than doing the drip method with the dripper because you only get one block and that's only four. And it takes a lot longer to get 32 clay. And this was really fast too. It was like uh, one second. So it took like two seconds once I had the two buckets of water and the two sand and gravel in there. So, and I made, I made a dirt out of a stack of saplings. So that's why that's on there. How much iron do we have? Oh, we got 10. That's two. This will be much better. Let's get this going. Uh, it'll be much better once we get a hopper hooked up to this. Uh, but I would like to get sand sifting uh, because we need to upgrade our mesh to gold so we can sift uh, dust to get redstone. So redstone's going to be our big hang up if we want to progress. Oh, let's check this guy. He's ready again. Now it says in the description you don't want to let this guy go over five minutes otherwise it'll start hurting you. And I did check it to make sure <laughs> on a previous playthrough. Finished. That's enough for a hopper. Yay! Ooh. Let's make a 
chest real quick while that's melting. Got some rewards to claim too. Oh, a, a hopper for my sluice. I'm still going to try and get this iron converted. So why not? It's just extra. Alright, let's put it here. And we can throw that in there. That's got that for two minutes. Let's go ahead and take uh, this stuff out. Put it in here. What does the different sluices get you? Sluice, because I know, no, we need to mesh. Mesh. Okay, if you look for gravel, oh, we're getting flint, and then with the iron mesh, oh, we still get flint. But we get a 10% more a 10% increase in iron chunks from converting up to a cloth mesh. Is there anything else different? I feel like there's something missing. One, two, three, four, six, seven, 13 items. You don't get gold at all with the iron, with gravel. Do you get it with dust? Yeah, you just get silver, gold, and nickel with dust. Oh, that's a cloth mesh. Yeah, you get the same amount of things. Like that. See, you only get electrotene with iron. See, you can mine redstone with the iron pick. I don't see why you can't get redstone with the iron mesh. See, you just get gunpowder and a, like a, another percent chance of getting gold. Okay. Awesome. We got it. We got the manual pump. We got the manual pump. We got the sluice upgraded. We got a hopper. We got a mesh upgraded. We got lots of good stuff done today. And we got some looting done. But before we go, we want to get our quest claim rewards. Uh, this just says, pump it louder. The manual pump is an early game mechanic that allows you to automatically pump water into sluices which otherwise don't support fluid automation. The pump first needs to accumulate energy by winding it up, right clicking the block, and then uses that slowed up energy to pull, stowed up energy to pull 1,000 millibuckets of water per second from an infinite water source below and push it into a connected sluice. Uh, beware it is. Beware though the spring lock mechanisms it uses are a bit finicky so it's best not to overstress it too much. Alright let's get a reward. Rod of the lands. Ooh if we had mana that would be pretty sweet. It would give us dirt. And 
Iron Sluice. Oh, the irony. A bit on the slow. Oh, we already read this one. Another auxiliary process seed. That's kind of cool, though, because the way you get diamonds... Uh, you have to do in a pulverizer at the very least I mean you can put it in a smeltery but you have to have like blazing blood or something like that uh, you can do emeralds in the smeltery but not diamonds so we made oh look at all the iron we got oh that is awesome uh, so Oh, we still have rewards to claim. Let's go ahead and get some of that smelting. What did we... Oh, storage. We made a drawer. An orange laser lens. And we got that augment. Terra steel leggings. <laughs> Okay. Oh, we got another quest reward from Misk. Oh, from getting the iron spikes and doing the cobble gen. A basic crate. That's that's pretty okay. Uh, saves me from making one. And an iron spike, which we looted. That's pretty okay. Protection wand. Okay, <laughs> and we also got the basic crate, magenta laser lens. I want to get to where I can actually use those laser lenses. Oh, it's out of water. Let's pump it up. Oh, I got an iron. Yeah, so I'm going to probably be sluicing it up in between episodes, trying to let this iron convert over here with the dripper as well, to try and get as much iron as possible and smelt up the iron that we have in here. Um, so next episode, we'll try and get into... Tinker's Construct to uh, double our smelting, which will be awesome. Let's put this in here. Get a basic crate, that's awesome. Um, I'll just wait for the other two. Oh, got the rod of the lands. Yeah, if we had mana, that would be great. But I don't know how to get... Um... Oh, yeah, you could make the floral fertilizer by using... But we don't need that right now. We, we're having plenty of fun. But anyway, <laughs> this is what I'm going to be doing in a little bit. Uh, so we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching, and bye-bye.